Hi lovelies, welcome back to my channel. I am back with a Louis Vuitton unboxing. <laughs> this is a hard to find Louis Vuitton item, so I'm super, super excited. I know, I know what you're thinking. And now you're telling me you've increased it again. I will not be getting this. Let me explain. If you haven't been here before, my name is Lorraine and my channel is Lori Lux and I love everything fashion, luxury, lifestyle and travel and if you love that too and I hope that you do, then please subscribe to my channel and also press that notification bell, it really really helps to support me, thank you very much. So before we start, as you can tell, I've got a new hairstyle, I'm back to black for now. I just want to give a shout out to my girl Dorian from DP Hair Closet who customized this wig for me. Like, can you see this? Do you see this? Where's the lace hunt? Because I can't see, okay? Thank you so much, girl. So I'm gonna link in all her details and her Instagram down below. Back to the Louis Vuitton unboxing. If you watch my luxury wish list for 2020, you will know that there are a few items on my luxury wish list. There was a Louis Vuitton price increase on the 5th of May. Check out that video if you haven't already, where I give my little opinion about why that's happened. A lot of the items that are on my wish list went up, right? But what I mentioned in that video is that I was stalking the websites on the 6th of May, really, really early in the morning. And that's when I saw that they had a price increase. And one of the items that's on my luxury wish list was back in stock. So I saw that there was a price increase. So I was having like a battle with myself. Should I buy it? Should I not? But because it's a hard to find Louis Vuitton item, I just thought, do you know what? I'm just going to do it because I had been hearing rumors. They're likely to increase their prices twice again in the space of the year so i knew that if i didn't buy it from from louis vuitton getting it pre-loved would have been more expensive because i had already been checking the pre-loved websites and people have been charging way more than the retail price even the increased retail price so that is my rationale okay before y'all come for my neck honey this is actually a true unboxing guys so this came yesterday and i just could not wait i had to make sure that i unboxed it with you guys so we can share this moment together so this is how it comes i already took off the ribbon and stuff because i filmed the little sneak peek um video for my instagram so that's why the ribbon looks like this but i haven't actually opened it i just remove the ribbon so I could just film that video. So let's get into the unboxing. So it comes in like a cardboard box that minimizes the chance of people stealing or your item not being delivered. And also you gotta make sure it, they have, it has to be signed for. So I absolutely love that. So here we go, guys. I'm so, so excited. Like I have been wanting this for the longest time. I can't believe I found it. Like it was just by chance. And people do say like, if you want, if you want anything from Louis Vuitton, you have to stalk the website constantly, which is exactly what I did. So anyway, you open it. And then the first thing that you, that you see is the receipt, which looks like this. Oh my God, it's super cute. I haven't bought anything from Louis Vuitton in such a long time. I haven't bought any luxury, in such a long time. So this is super, super exciting. You open up your receipt and then they're just thanking you for shopping from Louis. Even though we're mad at them for increasing the price, I'm still happy to have this, I can't lie. And then I've got my receipt here, which is great. So a good thing that they have said to me is that they have a 60 day return because obviously with everything that's happening at the moment, they have extended their return day. So if you're not happy with it for whatever reason, then you have got a longer period of time to then contemplate whether you want to keep it, whether you don't want to keep it oh and then you can return it to one of their stores which is absolutely fine oh my gosh okay i need to control myself i need to control myself so and then we then open it up and then i think you already know what this is you already know like if you know you know you know what this is so it comes in this louis vuitton dust bag which just says louis vuitton on it and is the iconic beige cream color so if we open it up dun 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 
Comment down below what you guys think this is. Like, pause the video and comment down below what you guys think this is. So, this is it. Ta-da! Look at her. My new baby. She's home. She's home. So, this is the Louis Vuitton toiletry pouch in the number 26. So, it's the largest of them all. Although it's a toiletry pouch, a lot of people use it for like clutch bags, things like that, which is exactly what I'm going to be doing, honey. The first thing I'm going to do is inspect it, child. Make sure the stitching is correct. Everything is supposed to be where it's supposed to be because I ain't finna have no mess because you know the quality of Louis can be a bit hit and miss sometimes. Okay, no double stitching, which is good. You don't want that. Lovely. Gonna open it up. Yep. Oh, gorgeous. Absolutely stunning. Oh my gosh, I love it. Okay, so far, so good. So where was this made? Ooh. Vuitton pack. Mine was made in Spain, okay? Because as you as you well know, they're made like in different locations, United States, Italy, Paris, and also Spain. I usually prefer when I get sent things from like Paris or Italy, like there's no specific reason, but I don't know, it just seems more luxury to me, especially if it's made from Paris. I'm just like, oh, oh my God, so, so happy. But I can live with Spain. We can live with her, okay? so this is her so it's in the iconic monogram print and i don't believe i have actually i do have my belt has got the monogram print and everything else look from louis vuitton that i have has got the damier print so it's good to have another monogram in my collection i'm so so happy i feel like with louis vuitton like with the colorway it's so versatile and you can use it with so many things like i had the i had the pochette which comes with the never fall but i lost that so we don't have that no more but do you know what this is so much better i don't know about you but retail therapy is so real for me with everything that's happening at the moment like i needed this it sounds so superficial but i really needed it i needed something to just boost me up and just do you know what i mean just make me happy give me something to look forward to so even though it was a bit pricier than i had hoped it was gonna be like i'm so happy that i have it so it took a couple of weeks for it to be delivered which i'm not mad at because i'm not going anywhere at the moment anyway and completely understandable with everything that's happening that shipping is going to be a little bit more extended so that's fine but i believe that on a usual normal times it would be up to a week that you might anticipate to get your item depending where it's being shipped from as well so because i'm in europe which is close to spain so maybe that's why it was within that two week region now if you know know the toiletry pouch 26 you know that the price previously before the Louis Vuitton price increase was 250 pounds okay I'm going to put the pricing in dollars because I'm not too sure at the top of my head but it was 250 pounds before the price increase and then when they put up prices it then went up to 350 pounds so it went up by a hundred pounds okay so this was a hundred pounds more that i hadn't budgeted on to be fair with you to be fair i hadn't budgeted i had not budgeted on this anyway for the month if i'm going to be completely honest it was a bit of an impulsive purchase because i came across it but not impulsive in the terms of oh my god this is the first time i've seen this and i really want it it was impulsive in the sense of it's a hard to find Louis Vuitton item and it's been on my luxury wish list and I genuinely want it. I can justify spending that extra £100 because I know that I'm going to get a lot of wear out of it. Because it's an SLG, it's obviously under £500. So it's, in my opinion, it's still, I can justify spending that amount of money 
I did say in my Louis Vuitton price increase video that I will not be getting some other Louis Vuitton items that were on my luxury wish list and I stand by that. I'm still contemplating a few other Louis Vuitton um, items, whether I'm going to get them or not, I'm not too sure. But for now, I have this new baby. We're happy to have her. And I know so many babes that have this and every single time I see them posting a picture or video so I'm like oh my god if only I had it and now I do now I do I'm so so happy let me know in the comment section down below guys what you think of my Louis Vuitton unboxing do you like me unboxing luxury items and doing luxury unboxing because at the moment I can understand that it's a little bit sensitive everything that's happening and I completely understand because everyone is in different situations but for me this is how I am coping with it this is my coping strategy and it's how I'm coping with everything that is happening what Louis Vuitton items do you guys have on your luxury wish list you're still considering or purchasing even when there's a price increase i would really, really love to know if you've come all this way you're a real one and i appreciate you make sure you've subscribed to my channel if you haven't already done so please give me a thumbs up if you've enjoyed this luxury unboxing i'd really really appreciate it make sure you're having a lovely day night evening wherever you are and i'm going to see you right back here in my next video bye guys